Greetings to you and yours. Welcome back to another episode of Fitty Ski and Field Tart. Kaiser Chiefs Neo, TS Galaxy 1. Kaiser Chiefs has lost two of his last three DSTV Premiership games. Do you think Kimbley Fentek is the right man for the job? Straight to the point, no. <laughs> why? Why? People would like to know with why would he, this guy is not the right man for the job. <laughs> no, I think even Kaiser Chiefs fans know this that he's not the right man for the job. I believe he's not, his tactics are, 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 are bad. If you ask me, his tactics are poor, poor, poor. I can't understand the gameplay. I can't understand what's the strategy of the team. I can't understand what direct, like what, yeah. what's the motive behind the, the, I don't, guys, I'm even lost for words because, <laughs> because I feel like, yeah. first of all, the Korean mean people complained and I was also one of them because I feel like his history, like guys, what did he do for which team? Yeah. Who, who found him where? What, like what's his background? What did he do for the team? I, I clearly don't know. And if you're going to ask me, I, I'm saying no, straight to the point. No, he's not. I don't think he's going to even get better. Yes, people are going to say coaches must get time. Give him more time. Give him more time. I for me already. Go and see. My be. Even their win against the Cape Town City, it was mm. very scrappy. Yeah. Right. Because they score like mm. towards the end of the game through a cross from Saile. Exactly. Then a, a, nice, a nice kick there by yeah. Castillo. Mm. But ah, man, like Kaiser are Chiefs, I'm not promising. Even our opportunities, they didn't have much opportunities compared to TS Galaxy. TS Galaxy are deserving winners, yeah, by the that, way. Yeah. If you're not watching the game, TS Galaxy had most opportunities. They were more threatening up front. Who impressed you the most? Google TS Galaxy. I mean, I'm impressed with Umbata. Oh, yes. And uh, this guy, Mujale. Yeah. And uh, the man of the match, Umbonjan. Yeah. Who, who impressed you the most there? Uh? No, for me, I'll be honest with you. I'm with you. I can't even fault you by saying all the. I think the boy also, the Brazilian Vidal, yeah, he, Vidal. he was also troubling them a bit. But I feel like for me personally, I don't think they got it wrong by saying man of the match in Bonja. And for the first time, we happy with the man yeah, of the match. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, he, he was very, very uh, vocal. All over the pitch. He so was eh, box yeah, to box. He was yeah. everywhere. You know, so I feel like he, he's, he's really good in midfield. I feel like Mbata was troubling everyone. Mbata was a problem today. Yeah. 38 years old, guys. Kichimangatina 20. Kiss a chisel. Beba kitchen is on 38. 38 years old, ah. giving a mart a problem. There was mm. a skill that Avalu Umart Konang. You understand? Ah. <laughs> yeah. Mm. So, but how much chances were? I'm not happy with how they played with how much chances were because if yeah. they were clinical, TS Galaxy would have scored more two, three yeah. goals. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. No, I'm going to agree with you with that because I feel like they missed. There's, okay, Peterson, well done. He did some, he made some good saves, you know. As much Is as it good saves though, or <laughs> it's just fortune? <laughs> <laughs> fortune favors the brave. Fortune favors the brave. So he was brave, you know in terms of getting into those positions and making sure that he doesn't react late. He was quick to react. Yeah. So the saves were, let's say, luck. I know you're going to say it's luck because it all came straight towards him. Yeah. When I like saving Endo, no? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. yes, but fortune favors the brave. He's brave to, you know, come out yeah, and, on time out. and yeah, do yeah. those saves, you know? So for me personally, I feel like he, he, he kept them in the game because if it wasn't yeah. for him, would easily would have been 3-4. Sure. Easy. Yeah. You know, and I don't know, bro, did, besides the one where I think it was Shiva Viro heading the ball and knocking the post. Yeah, yeah. And then Usaile coming on and the one on one way he, he, he went in you know, his pace real well yeah. done boy. Getting in the ball away from uh, the defender. I can't remember who it was yeah. and slotting it wide. But that's it. Do you remember anything convincing that Kaiser Chiefs did besides the two the two things that I just mentioned? Um the old, the last time they they, they were at, they were attacking threats it was in the first half. Yes. The second half they were just passing the ball, getting corners, but nothing. Yeah. Even on all their set pieces, mm. nothing converted from those set pieces. It was guys, Kaiser Chiefs. I don't know what's going on, guys. Uh. These guys signed more than eight players. Yes. That's like a revamp of the entire team. Exactly. But still, they're still struggling. Oh. You yeah, understand? Mm -hmm. Poor gameplay. Mm -hmm. Our players are not combining. I don't know if maybe we are being harsh because it's only the third game. Yeah. You yeah, understand? Yeah, yeah. But this is a team we expect to, to not be beaten by a TS Galaxy, no, guys. Come no. on. Come on. No disrespect to ETS Galaxy, Please. but Chiefs didn't come to the party. Like, ETS Galaxy convincingly win, won this game. Yeah. You yeah, understand? Yes. They could have won. Nah, no opportunities, nothing. Bro, I, I'm going to put it straight to the point. And you people must not 
be saying, hey, these guys don't like Kaiser Chiefs in Guys, Kaiser Chiefs is weak. Yeah. <laughs> Kaiser Chiefs is weak. Yeah. Kaiser Chiefs looks like they are the new sec like Polukwane City or the new Cheaper United. Because yeah. it's what you just said now. They're just passing the ball. But it doesn't go into the dangerous areas. Yeah. You let's be honest, Kaiser Chiefs' best chance of scoring, if you looked at this game, was through La Makona kick. Yeah. So they basically need Amaset pieces exactly. to score a goal. They can't break away in open play and score a goal. They can't do that. So hence I say, for me, Kaiser Chiefs is playing like an average team. They're looking way too average right now. It's like they didn't sign A players. And yeah. that's a lot of money. I'm pretty sure they invested there and they're expecting like exactly. solid results. There. You signed Modi. You signed um, Tanzani. You signed Potane. They all started the game. All, all the new signings started the game. Like Chiva Vira, Vira, yeah, Chiva Vira also started. That's four new signings. If I'm honestly speaking, let's be honest. When you sign for a team, especially you sign for Kaiser Chiefs, you want to make sure that you're proving your point. You want to make sure that yeah. you're proving to say, this is why I got signed. This is why I'm playing. But those guys are not... This game, they didn't show up. Last game, I liked the fact that Potane showed a, a, a bit of courage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did well. He went flat this time around for me, my opinion. I feel like Um Tansani tried this game. He tried, but he didn't have much support. Castillo, I feel like mm. the, the, the link up between Castillo, mm. Mart and Um Tansani is not... For yeah. me, I don't know. It's not working for me. It's not... Yeah, maybe they still have to play yeah, more yeah, so it can yeah, link up yeah. better. But it's not working because I know they like to swing in Usteb and I... Ah, it's just too much going on in the middle of the park. For me, I, man, I don't know, man. It's not working for it's me, man. I know it's not, it's not connecting. Yeah. And it's just... It's looking too messy. It's what we said the last game. It's way too messy from Kaiser Chiefs. Yeah. This time again, it's way too messy. Just the, this time they got paid. They, made, they were way too paid for this time. Because yeah. the last time at least they won. But yeah. they didn't have the best of games. This time they lost. But it's a deserving lose, guys. You deserve to lose. Yeah. Whoever doesn't want to tell you, they must tell you. You guys deserved to lose today. Because it was a bad performance. Yeah. It was bad all around. The defense also, I mean, balls over the top. You'll expect to the clock and not given to win those things yeah. all the time. They giants at the back. They two tall players. Yeah. A ball over the top. Ishao Kiven, which is unexpected of him, because I know those are his things. He easily wins those things, you know. So yeah. ball over the top, he misjudges it. Yes, it happens. Recovery, not the best. Kosopo gets the time to turn and put the dangerous ball into the box. Yeah. That's how the goal came. And so then, for me personally, the defending of Ikeza Chiefs, long ball, I expect them to win it. They two tall giants at the back. It's too obvious. Yeah. Midfield, you'll expect them to link up. I think Mart now is also dropped. We said this before, we're saying it again. His performance went down. He's not, he's not giving the team And he was the man of the match last time. Ah, <laughs> yeah. There's no way you might... This was this, almost this, the yeah. photocopy of what he did the last time. You yeah. know what I'm saying? He hardly gets shots, what we know him to do, take it from, from range. He doesn't do that anymore. He hardly gets high up the pitch. He hardly gives dangerous passes anymore. Yeah. So, I will coach you take sinking in. I in trouble. Then, <laughs> me, Nane... Mm. My my biggest takes were the wingers because you know they yeah. they play through the wingers yeah. and, and they, they exp yeah they expect Ama Ama crosses to come in there. Yeah. Mori Potani, mm -hmm. to me they were a disappointment today. Yeah, you understand because I didn't see Mori doing anything mm -hmm. the entire game and they played ninety minutes. Imagine. Pule Mori played ninety minutes today. It doesn't make sense. Potani he was flat 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 taken out. Then mm. Tutuzi uh, Shabalala yeah. comes in. I also didn't see him the entire game. Like, to do Shabalala, like, I haven't seen much of the boy. I've heard a lot about him, but, like, nothing. He didn't deliver today. Wait, what do you think about him, Don? No, Mina, I, I, I don't like yeah. you. I liked him yeah. in, in MTC days. He did a very, very good job. Yeah. I was one of the people that raised my hand to say promote him. Yeah. You know? So I, I, I think even now, I can't really say he's tough for, for, for game time because the coach has been playing him starting sometimes, sometimes off the bench. You just said it now. He came on. He didn't do much. As I, I'm, I'm big on this, guys. If you're a substitute and you're watching the game, yeah. you see all the gaps. You see where you have to go in and change the game because you're watching the game, guys. You yeah. had enough time to adjust to say, okay, sharp. Long at your leg, hello. Mangena. Yeah. So when you come on and you do the same thing that somebody already was doing, guys, then then why, why are you coming on? Mara, on the hind side, ne? Bega. We can attack. I'm a, I'm a player. I'm a player with yeah. City. They were yeah. flat. But let's talk about Umvelas. The 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 the, the, yeah. the different the uh, right back. The right back yeah, of of E T S Kelix. Yeah. I think it was solid, bro. Was I think he did a good job with Potan. That's why Potan mm. was flat. He also did a great job yeah. with Ushabala. Yeah. Yeah. Like Umchita, Umchita did well, bro. No, I'm agreeing with you. I'll rest a man. I'll span I'll chamanu span in the fender. Umvelas did a good job. He got so high up the pitch. 
for yeah, a right back to get so high up a pitch and look like he's a winger it yeah. shows you go to go line line it's a highway exactly it's a, <laughs> you understand? <laughs> you understand? So he saw that ah, there's no need for me to stay at the back. I was attacking. Let me go and add numbers to our attack. Yeah. And he got there. And the coach actually clapped for him so many times. He was happy for his yeah, performance. Yeah. You know, Velas was solid. Exactly. So Um Velas did a good job. Um Bunjane did a good job. Yeah. Um Bata did a good job. I think Vidal also did a good job. So for me personally, if you're going to ask me, I'm going to say. Even if Umbunjan didn't get the man of the match, there were still three more options that had to come from Kelix. <laughs> there the was no one Kelix. from Chiefs that can keep the man of the yeah, match too. Yeah. I think the closest can be maybe call keeper now, maybe in a yeah, corner. Yeah, yeah. Because yes, it's a own goal, but I, don't, I wouldn't blame him so much because it's a deflection. Yeah, yeah. Unlucky, unlucky. Yeah, unlucky. you understand, can't fault him. So he's he's by far the guy that's at least trying to prove himself in the team of Kaiser Chiefs. But let's not take away Ishine. I like that you said. We can't take away Ishine of ETS Galaxy. ETS yeah. Galaxy played very well today, guys. Let's be honest. They were solid, bro. Velasco. Ah. And Velasco was nice, Ooh. man. Botani all over the pitch. Ah, yeah, yeah. There was a time where I was scared which was a totally red card. Mm. You understand? Mm. Even, I think, yeah. even the technical team mm. like, was scared. Mm. But they still kept him in. Young yeah. tall. They took yeah. a gamble and the guy, it paid, it paid off. It paid off. It paid off very well. But let's talk about the goal. You understand okay. so a lot of people who didn't watch the game how the goal came up was um it was a, a forward ball long long ball uh-huh. by ts galaxy yeah. then it was supposed to be just an easy uh one clearance by ukiven sure. young tall sure. ukiven ukiven yeah. then he made a mistake then um that guy we we die when you want to forget his name but that yeah. guy while the car bipolar then this yes. guy from Brazil, Vidal. Uh, Vidal. Then Vidal hit the post, post back on yes. and then it's a Ush. goal. Yeah. What do you think about TK Miagala? I know you touched about I'm a, I'm a yeah. aerial balls where yeah. you should do good, but that mistake, man. No, it's what I said before, and I'm going to touch on it again because, yeah. like I said, misjudgment of a ball, a long ball, is bad for a defender, especially yeah. a center back. Yeah. And you know what's the most dangerous thing any coach can tell you? You don't want to have your center backs running towards goal when the ball is playing long. You yeah. want him to anticipate it so he can jump and get it out. That's what any coach, one on one, coaching one on one, will tell you that. Yeah. You can't have a situation where the ball is hit long and you're chasing it going to your own goal oh. post. It's a bad thing. Already, that's a mistake. So I feel like that was already the first mistake that he did. Because he yeah. tur- as soon as he turned, if you watch the game, you see he tried stretching, yeah. trying to get the ball, already facing his goal post, yeah. which already is not even guaranteed because you can't even see the ball. You're yeah. just anticipating and then you're trying to stretch your leg out. Already, it's wrong. And he didn't get it. You know, At least if he got it, then at least it would look like something good, you know? Yeah. But he didn't even get that ball. So already, that's bad. Then maybe, I feel like maybe he could have covered the boy on the stronger side, al- not allowing him to turn in again, you know? Yeah. But yeah, it's things that he can work on, man. Uh, yeah. For me, I won't. F- I, I'm not gonna that. say you're gonna be too hard on the Kaiser Chiefs, but guys, the mistakes are. Ah, man, it's, it's, uh, game, it's, it's the game of football. It's a game of mistakes. Yeah, no, no, no. But Mina, let me tell you what I think about Kevin. I think okay. Kevin, Kevin is a solid defender, yeah. but I think he was complacent today because he was playing against his former team. Oh yeah, oh, you yes. understand? Oh, yeah. I think he took yeah. them for granted. Some we are good. Ah, but at Chicago and Joe Bennett Parker, yeah. they're gonna try to do this yeah. and that and that. Endings of Abba and Bayang Sol. I think he was complacent. He was too relaxed. Even that mistake, mm. I, like he wasn't harsh on himself. Which yeah. is, guys, of course the goal. Mm. And you man just said, you know, I think he still felt like they're going to come back. He was complacent. We can win. Yeah, and I agree. It, it caused the loss. It yeah. caused the loss. You understand? Yeah. That's what I think, me. No, I agree. Guys, it's just my thought process. <laughs> it's no. not, it can't be true, but it's just what I'm analyzing. No, no, no. I'm going to be with you on that one. I feel like, yeah. yes, he was maybe a bit too relaxed. I saw some of the few passes. The game just started. Yeah. And he already made a mistake with the pass. Yeah. So it's maybe the thing of, hey, Tim Yam, I understand yeah. them. Maybe he thought maybe he already knew the tactics and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. You might never know, guys. Coaches change the tactics all the time, you know? Yeah, exactly. So it might have not been the way he thought the game would be. High press. But like Galaxy sometimes came with a high press. Mm-hmm. Sometimes they relaxed. So yeah. they were switching it up. So it was difficult for them to cram to say, what are they going to do now? Yeah. You know? So yes, he was a bit too complacent. Ah, something he has to fix on. Because he uh, as a defender, center back. You can't be making too many mistakes. Yeah. You know, you Especially can't. when the results are not coming in for yeah. the team. No, 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 you can't. So for me, 
Hey, you really think take a really shang on my line? You saw some line I'm more. Stress. Saw some more and go. Still gonna scratch that head because hey, the guys are really letting him down, man. I don't yeah. wanna lie, the guys are letting him down. Already t- Chiefs had politics with in that was a piliati. So uh, today they lost to a retirement home today. <laughs> Bro, today they lost I, to a retirement I would home. like to see average age of a TS Galaxy. I'm oh. sure it's 30 years. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure the average uh, age is 30. Mbata was like, Mbata is 38. Ooh, Park, I think it's like 37, 38. <laughs> oh. Mbunjan is running, but my 30 something. The same point that we spoke about now, um, Velasa thinks also in his 30, 30 Yo, 34. Bro, 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 yeah so, so the guys are like in yeah. their 30s guys and, and 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 you have people like modi you have people like umtansani you have people yeah. like upotsani youngsters run at them guys yeah. trouble them you understand you have to ask questions yeah ah, today guys it's why i think when we were watching the game myself and you i i told you that modi and umpotsane i feel like are not giving the team much in the final third meaning yeah. they're not getting to the box as much as you would want a winger to get to the box sure, sure. they play m- wide yes they come and help the team deep and win the ball okay mm. then going forward there's not much options because every time someone gets the ball it's way too far to get to the next man so yeah. they're going to play short passes trying to get the ball going forward it's late when they get the ball back now oh my is forced to hit the long ball yeah. comes to given it's forced to hit the long ball because he pressure sailor yeah. so i feel like he, he that's i say i i, I wish to you know hear a proper proper post-match interview of Muli Fenteke and he has to tell us what was the game strategy. I feel like even I'm a super sport uh, analyst yeah. then asking questions. No, I'm too late, man. Yeah. Why do we? Yeah. They must ask him, what was your strategy? As much as we saw the game, what was your strategy going into this game? Yeah. How did you want to win this game? What was your vocal pointers of attacking ETS Galaxy? Yeah. Because for me, it looked like they were playing too safe. They were... It, Chiefs came in looking like they wanted to get the throw. First first few minutes, yes, they yeah, came with the yeah, header. Yeah, yeah. Then maybe Saile coming in, it looked a bit fresh. Then it went flat. Guaranteed, I, if you look at possession, I'm sure it has like 70, 80. Yeah. Which shows you that they, they, they wanted this more than the Chiefs. And you can, nobody can argue with us on that one. Yeah. TS Galaxy wanted this game more, more than the Chiefs. They had more chances. You understand? Yeah. Look at the celebration they did after the game. That's about winning the World Cup. <laughs> yeah, it was like we, they won the league. You understand? That's about winning the World Cup. Yeah. So it proves you that they were hungry for this. It's a question that I asked you before, while we were watching the game. Do you think he the Chiefs Chiefs? You baby a little late. Do they camp oh, before he came? Oh, they do camp. Every, ah. every team camps, bro. Like, every team camps. Ah. But I don't know what they do in my campaign again. Ah. Some they relax and play PlayStation. Ah. Oh, they do my tactics and they practice the set pieces and what. I don't know. Yeah. But surely, young top. But obviously, from their gameplay, it's a valid question because you'll want to ask, what are they doing with training session if they're not combining? What mm. are they doing? Young Tola, in their planning for the games, mm. Young Tola, because every team is confident when it's about to play in the Kaiser Chiefs. Yeah, thank you. Like every single thank team you. is confident against mm. Kaiser Chiefs, and that's not a good sign. Mm-hmm. It seems, I'm a team Milan Sab, in fact, yes. every team here is Abi Sundowns, and it's because of their play. Thank you. <laughs> big team. You are considered a big team. Sundowns, Chiefs, Pirates, yeah. guys, you considered, you considered the big teams. Every team that plays against you, yes, they're going to go one better. Because everybody wants to get signed by each Chiefs. Chiefs, Chiefs must yeah. sign me. I'll play one better. But yes. they are too confident. They feel you understand? every team that plays case the Chiefs feels like they can beat them. Soon soon enough, if you don't if we don't watch, guys, that's it's early in the season. And Funu Chachi Chiefs too much. But if they're gonna keep at this rate, every team's gonna see three points. Every team's gonna see three points. Because it's so it's so obvious now to see that every team that Chiefs plays against has more chances than the Chiefs. Yeah. So Bona they trusting on I don't know what to say. Oh, please, they mustn't score. Kind of game, maybe score again. We win the game because you you swear that Chiefs. Unless I don't know, but 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 okay, jenga ma pogo pogo mara. But then jenga pa fana ba fana for me because they 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 playing like iba fana ba fana. They trusting on I don't know what for them to win the game. Ah, but at least like but at least what? Chiefs are Chiefs playing shit, guys. Sorry for the language, but you guys are playing crap, 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 crap. Ah, it's horrible, too. And another oh. blow. Hi. Dupree's is injured. Mm-hmm. Shiva Vero left the game early, injured. Mm-hmm. So they don't have a, uh, someone they can put as a striker. Yes, Saile was put yeah. there, but like it was, uh, he disappeared. He was go- he ghosted uh, second half, especially yeah. second half. After that chance he had on the first half, he ghosted the entire second half. I didn't see Saile second mm-hmm. half, bruh. I didn't see him touching no, the ball. Mm-hmm. 
like not even like a couple of times yeah, yeah so so it, it's gonna be a blow now they don't have forwards that they can trust that can, can score for them you understand mm, and at the same time they are, they've not combined yet because mm. there's a lot of new players yeah. you understand the people that need also need to understand that mm. but obviously losing two out of the three games mm. that's not good that's not good and 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 mind you you must know my friends which kaiser chiefs they're not patient ne? yeah kaiser chiefs fans are impatient yes we can say it's early in the season which is a fact guys and they have too many new players which is a fact so let's say we must give them time to gel yeah one can say that mm. but there has to be promising signs as much as you're saying a team must gel i mean let's give them time there must be at least a few promising signs that show good you know there's something that the, the coach can still work with to yeah. make it better i'm hardly seeing that that's why i say Kaiser Chiefs are not impatient. They're going to start asking questions of Muli Fenteki. Already, they didn't want him in the team. People yeah. are not happy about his acquisition to be the head coach. Dylan Shepard is still there. So, new players, same coaching staff besides the head coach. Hey, guys, I, I see problems. I'm, 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 I'm with the, the, the thing of let's give them time to adjust. Yeah. Maybe they can become better, you know. Yeah. I mean, they did. They they already threw to the semifinals against Suntowns. <laughs> but <laughs> yeah. But anyway, you know, let's give them the benefit of the doubt and say new players. Too many new players. They still need to gel. They maybe need to, you know, get into the groove of things. Yeah. But they need to get the, the winning spirit, or else, hey, I don't get my support the crown in. Okay, let's play the right? Do you see them beating Suntowns? Like everybody knows. It, it, there's a high chance of Gutibas will lose, but do you see them pick things in Santos? Google FTA. Never. Chiefs, okay. chi- honestly, uh, Chiefs is one of the teams that trouble Sundowns. I don't know if it's by luck. Statistically, or yeah, yeah. But hey, no, I don't think they're going to do it anytime. Not right so, now. No, 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 no. Now I don't see it happening because, as you said, every team that plays Chiefs is so confident that they're going to win the game because Chiefs is giving them. That thing to say, I Tatani, I'm a points, guys. We are gift of the givers. We're giving. We're yeah, giving. Yeah, yeah. You understand? So for me, I don't think they're gonna beat Sundowns. Both legs. First leg, second leg, both yeah. games, I think they're gonna lose both. My, okay. my opinion. Let's play a game. We're gonna rate each and every <laughs> every player of the case <laughs> chiefs out of ten for the game. Yeah. Um Pirtasin, I'm giving him a four out of ten, you know? I'll say seven. Seven. Yeah, yeah seven. I did well. <laughs> seven out of ten. No, I him I'll give him. Refrosla, I think it was also yeah. solid. Five out of ten. Ah, you being harsh, bro. Are you being harsh? How? Being they harsh. lost. I, ca- I, can't, yeah. I can't rate him high. They lost. No, but Frosto was good. Frosto, yeah. Frosto was one of the best players in the team today for me. So we're going to rate I'll him higher than say, Peterson? No, not higher than Peterson. Peterson for me was the best player on the pitch. I'll say six out of ten. For me, he was good. Six and a half, seven, six. Yeah, he was good. He was okay. Uh, was the talk, uh, the talk yeah, I'm going to say five. Um, Simang, because of the mistake, I'm going to say four. Mm. Clanty um he wasn't he wasn't too clumsy yeah five okay i'll say the talk way i'm with you i'll say five given i'll drop him to four because yeah he had a bit of too many mistakes today given i'll say four plenty i'm gonna i'm gonna not be harshing him tonight because i think he did a uh, a good job he was covering there's twice where he came from his side where there was no danger danger on frosted side when the cross came in he was the man to clean it out so i'm gonna say Six, 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 six yeah, out of yeah, I'm gonna have yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. <laughs> Castillo, um, I'm gonna give him a six. Um yeah. Mart, I'm gonna give him a four. It was poor to me. Mtanzani was poor, I'm gonna give him a four out of ten. I'm gonna disagree with you with Mtanzani. Tanzani wasn't poor, he was he was okay. He why was this why was he substituted? Yeah, I feel like <laughs> it's what I'm saying, the final third. Yeah. I mean a coach is gonna get frustrated, guys, with someone that's looking good. Mm. but not giving you the end result the end result is guys get goals yeah goals win your games without goals it's, it's no use you understand yeah so on to one i'm going to say five i'll be lenient on him i think he was okay Marat, i'm going to be very harsh on him for me he's <laughs> dropped <laughs> I, I think you have a problem with you Mark. <laughs> you know what's the issue of of, of, of supporters yeah. you guys celebrate one achievement for the rest of your lives yeah yes he did one thing good we're happy for him but it needs to continue, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Sundowns if players continue all the time. Yeah. Look at Orlando Paris now. They, the players are consistent. They're continuing with the good performances, you know? Yeah. That's why you're happy to see that. Oh, man. Oh, man. Three out of ten. I'm sorry. <laughs> ah, no, you was poor. Then Mtanzane. Mtanzane, I said five. Oh, I'm missing. Oh, Castillo. 
yeah he got a few tackles in his passes were okay he tried to make the team tick i feel like he didn't have support structure no one supporting him five 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 out of ten five out of ten out of then ten. i'm gonna be harsh to the wingers potani was poor yeah, two out of ten uh mori i didn't see him the entire game yeah. two out of ten obviously vera can't be too harsh he left too early due to the injury i'm not gonna rate him then um Sahile, i expected mo- like a, a lot mm. from him especially after he performed last week he did well when he came in last week i think he ghosted the second half yeah, i'm gonna give him a three out of ten. Oh, yeah i know <laughs> 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 okay i will start again i'll say me for me personally modi terrible yeah but i he looked, did he play the 90 minutes he tried dribbling ah guys <sighs> <laughs> you know, two out of ten also for me for yeah. me he wasn't even supposed to start the game i won't lie but I'll, yeah he started the game two out of ten puts on it three to four he tried taking on but he wasn't winning the uh, like you said Mvela said they was too strong for him i feel like yeah, they were Velasse, way too good for him chiva vero in the few minutes that he had yeah four five he tried doing something but i'm not his biggest fan I'll just put it out there for me he's not a striker <laughs> for me no i'm I, really? why why no, 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 what's no. the agenda with chiva no, vero um, to me le pambi he hardly gives the team much yes Le- chiefs is not a team that plays direct football to the striker because you like they, they build too much at the back i feel like they build too much in the at the back instead of the middle and the front you know what i'm saying yeah. so if they build much at the back you expect the striker to drop deep and fetch the ball you know yeah. come and help out in midfield also so at least we have more options to go out oh yeah. boy is, is calm but i won't i'm not going to be too harsh on him to at this game yeah. because he proved to me that he can at least can do something he had the ball back from where the keeper's coming from. That's good from a striker. Every striker's been told that you had the ball where the keeper comes from because there's no chance for him to get it. Yeah. So he did that. He just he had to go down. I feel like he just had to keep it low. Would have been a goal. Would have been clapped for him, you know. Yeah. But it didn't work out. But me personally, I'm not his biggest fan because I just feel like he's not the out-and-out striker that Kaja Chiefs needs right now. Saile in the position in strike is actually looking much more better than U. Uchiva Vero for me personally. Yeah. So I'll say Saile when he came on, he tried doing something five also for him, but... Yeah, and I pambile chiefs needs uh, but 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 thing unkulu unkulu. I know. Yeah. <laughs> so so I, okay. I know. So you rate him say what? I'll say five, five four. He didn't do much. I'm with you. I think he did well by getting that pace beating because he came from behind. Don't forget. Yeah. He beat the defender. He was so strong. The defender looked comfortable in winning the ball, yeah. and he stretched his leg and he got the ball from the striker. Yeah. From the defender, sorry. So he did well and he placed it unfortunately wide. I think it was even his weaker foot, you know. Yeah. So I'll say I won't be you know, five. I'll give him five because I think he tried where he could do something. He, at least he did something. He went wide to face the ball sometimes. Yeah. Tried helping the wingers because we were flat, na we were swak. So yeah, but I uh, know for me five. All, all in all, for, if I have to rate the Chiefs, the entire, the entire performance four out of ten. Four out of ten. Eh? Four out of ten. I'll, 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 I'll give you the three out of ten. <laughs> they, they were poor. No chances created. They no. were just. Using bangers to be seven hundred and position that they had, you understand? Yeah. They didn't like show good a game plan. They didn't mm-hmm. look like a team with a game plan. Then moving to TSK Lex in Mojale, yeah. I'm giving me seven out of ten. Mm-hmm. I'll give um um Bonjane. Bonjane eight out of ten. Okay. The men of the match give um uh, Umvelase okay. eight out of ten. I'm gonna give keep a can rate him because he wasn't oh. tested. Um, I'm gonna give um, what do you think of Vidal? Vidal, Vidal also, I think six out of ten for me. Uh, Parker, he yeah. was all over the pitch, yeah, seven well. out of ten. He played well. Then, uh, who else are we forgetting? Bata, Bata, eight out of ten. It was brilliant. Yeah, Bata was good. Yeah, then uh, now, what no. are your ratings for it? Yes, I don't want to disagree with you with anything. Yeah, I think you got it spot on. Everyone yeah. was but Parker guys. Parker was good. Yeah, well, Parker was good. Parker, Parker was involved in that game. Can yeah. you see when I say midfield when they link up? It's yeah. so good because they support each other, guys. They're not far from each other. You know, you want your midfielders to be a bit closer. So yeah. Munja and Parker did a very very good job. They made Ispan Saga Vidal easy because Vidal is not forced now to drop far back yeah, and help yeah. because his job is a bit easier now up front. You know, because the guys oh, oh, he knows oh. even if he makes a mistake, we need protection. Yeah. He's protected by Upaka uh, and Umbonjana. Umbonjana was working super hard. We call a play like that a bulldozer. He was bulldozing yeah. in the midfield. Young and yeah. So I like Umbonjana. I'm going to give him a higher score. I'll say for me, 9 out of 10 for me. Yeah, I'll say Parker, 8 out of 10. Yeah. Vidal, 7 out of 10 for me. Umbata, 9 out of 10. I, I liked him. Drifting, yeah. troubling yeah. Amachita. 
I must want two skills, and his skill is to go forward. Not yeah. the skill, my yeah, uh, young yeah. yeah. So, um, but I'm gonna, um, I like him now, um, but I think he did a very But he still job. needs to work on his finishing. Eh? Yeah, yeah, no, I, yeah, let's talk about the finishing of TSK Galaxy. <laughs> <laughs> we did, we did touch on it. Ah, they yeah. are poor. In yeah, finishing. yeah, their finishing is poor. Whoa. And they, uh, they have a nice interplay, bro. Yeah. And they have skillful players, I understand. Mm. But, like, I don't know what happened. But Kabi Paul under 15. Yeah. That is under 15. Yeah, their Get finishing the is poor. Yeah. You're passing Peterson the ball. You could have killed him, guys. You could have gotten more, more, more better results, more calmer results. Yeah, yeah. No need to be nervous towards the ending, you know? Yeah. But I really thought T.S. Kelis was going to play helicopter. Bro. And they kept it on the floor and they played. Every team is confident against Chiefs. <laughs> <laughs> Every team is confident against Chiefs. But guys, yeah, that's the gist of it. That's our conversation about yeah. the game. Thank you for tuning in and for reaching this far. We really love you. Thank we you. out. You know Thank the drill. So